Now, here's meteorologist Michelle Muscatello with your Pinpoint Weather 12 forecast. Well, we've had a, a cool and mainly dry night. We have had some sprinkles and some extra cloud cover around in East Providence. You may notice a raindrop or two as you head into work this morning. It shouldn't be anything that would slow you down. Newport, we're looking at a fine visibility heading over the bridges. Upper 50s in Newport right now. Providence as well, just below 60 degrees. We're 55 in Smithfield and 56 right now in New Bedford, while Boston is in the upper 50s, where the skies uh, had clearer conditions. The temperatures dropped a cool into the upper 40s in Springfield, but we've got a deck of clouds moving over our area. Then you can see some of the moisture on shore here from the winds out of the northeast, bringing in some sprinkles for us this morning. And there's the cloud cover with it. You can see it pressing from north to south. So we'll start off the morning under partly to mostly cloudy skies and then clear things out through uh, the late morning and afternoon. Cool winds blowing, leading our three key things. Our temperatures will be about 10 degrees below normal. You add into that a northeast wind gust of 25 miles per hour. You got the makings of a a very fall like feel today. It's a quiet stretch of weather though. We have some sprinkles this morning. Not a big deal, right? Little to no rain in the next seven to 10 days. Tracking a front late Monday and Monday night may bring a shower for Lockie uh, in the overnight hours Monday and then a warming trend after a very chilly start tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, we'll start to see some warmer conditions and it'll last all the way through the upcoming weekend. For this morning, clouds breaking for some sunshine. You can see those temperatures uh, climbing up into the lower 60s by lunchtime. That's well below normal in the afternoon. Maybe breezy and cool. Northeast winds about 10 to 15 miles per hour sustained with those higher gusts. Mid 60s in westerly away from the ocean influence of those winds out of the northeast. Whitford at about 63. Newport low 60s. Lower 60s in Johnston, East Providence and West Warwick Burrowville today, a 62 degree high when socket low 60s and you're going to want to to dress for an October feel in Taunton and Attleboro lower 60s for your temperature out on the bay. Uh, we do have uh, some high uh, winds that that's going to create a small craft advisory. Northeast winds 10 to 20 knots of uh, waves around two feet and we're starting to see some of the influence here from distant Hurricane Umberto along our coastline. Moderate rip current risk today along our shore. That's like to grow to a high rip current risk, especially on Friday. Here's that hour by hour forecast talking about a cool evening on the way after seeing our afternoon highs in the lower to mid 60s. By six o'clock in the evening, we're already cooling into the 50s. So if you've got a practice or activity outside after school, it's going to cool down quickly as the sun goes down. 11 o'clock tonight, upper 40s to low 50s, and this will likely be the coolest night of the season for us so far, down between 40 and 45 degrees in many spots. High pressure, though, in control and going to keep us dry. Here's Hurricane Umberto. It's a major hurricane right now moving to the northeast at 16 miles per hour, 115 mile per hour sustained winds. Now expected to be a category three as it moves up past uh, Bermuda. They're under a hurricane warning there and a track well to the south and east of us anticipated. And you can see how it brings some of those higher wave heights over the next couple of days. So if you do plan to take advantage of the warm days that we have here at the end of the week and weekend, you want to use some caution at the beaches. There are no lifeguards on uh, monitoring the beach conditions uh, and there will be likely a high rip current risk Friday and possibly Saturday 64 today that jumps up to 70 tomorrow 80 on Friday low 80s over the weekend and again a very quiet stretch ahead your full forecast on WPRI